and I are in the car headed to the mountain. We're going to go do some uh, looking this evening to see what we can find. And we have a little hole that we want to go look in tonight. We brought some uh, some salt and stuff like that to put down a trail cam. And we stopped and got batteries, new batteries and everything for the trail cam. And uh, what did we forget, Jacob? The SD card. We forgot the SD card. Doesn't do us a dang bit of good. Anyways, we're on the road and we are going to go see what we can find tonight. Hopefully we'll find something good and be able to uh, get some video of it and uh, do a little bit of show and tell on, uh, on this week's vlog. Up the road and a bunch of highway patrolmen with lights. Lights flying everywhere, red and blue and white lights and they pushed us right over to the side of the road because look at what's coming down the road here. Look at this. Massive, massive, massive caterpillar beds. Is there two of them? Here comes another one. Let's see if we can get you a good view of this baby. Look at this thing coming down the road here. Look at this thing. They're so stinking big, they're taking up like two and a half lanes. They're massive, I couldn't believe it. Anyways. We're back on the road now, so here we go. We just got back and as you can tell outside it's dark had to come out in the headlamps but we uh, we found we saw a couple of elk and we saw oh half dozen deer we did see one buck a little four point uh, let's see if we can show you what we saw here we can get either one of the boys on him right here this weekend uh, we'd be pretty happy He's a four point and uh, he's about 24 inches wide. There he goes. Anyways, he's pretty tall, a little four point. Not too bad, little buck there. If we could get one of the boys on him this weekend, opening day of the archery hunt, that would be, that would be pretty stellar. Get one of those boys on him for first archery buck, that would be pretty awesome. Well, we had a good hike, put on a couple of miles, saw some good country, and now we're headed home. Talk I'll start with mesh, but we had a good hike, and now it's time to put in some wilderness athlete, baby. Put in some wilderness athlete, hydrate and recovery, and get a good drink before we head home. And get hydrated up after that hike. So. Make it up, Jake. I want some drink. I'm thirsty. Let's go. The package is beating him up. It's beating him. Oh, there you go. Mix that baby up. Let's have a drink. Hydrate and recovery. Wilderness athlete. Good stuff, guys. Seriously, if you uh, if you need some uh, performance uh, supplements, great stuff. Wilderness athlete. Um, they got one that is energy and focus. I got one that is uh, hydrate and recovery. They got meal replacement shakes. They got, you know, um, I have one that I took.
while in the UN is a couple weeks ago. Uh, it's called Altitude Advantage, and it's a it's a great little uh, little pill you take to help your body acclimatize to going up to high altitudes. And man, it makes a difference, I tell you. Anyways, if Jacob will hurry up and uh, get us a drink down here, then uh, then we'll have a drink and we'll head home. All right, Jake, mix it up, buddy. This thing's kicking his butt. I think this one is, uh, this one, I don't know if you can see it. It's like lemon lime flavor right there. Lemon lime. Mmm, wilderness athlete, lemon lime. Hydrate and recovery, baby. Tasty? Yeah, it doesn't taste too bad. Pretty good. Lemon lime. Love it.